Ali, Ali, I'll put his name up here. And he took me on a fantastic second day tour. We went to a market because I wanted to get a traditional Balinese sarong. Didn't go very well. Long story, didn't end up with one. Balinese women are very small, couldn't find one. And the material is quite heavy as well. And I wanted something lighter because obviously putting it in my backpack. After that, we went to a temple and then we, <laughs> and then we drove on to my new accommodation in Cedarman. And this is my story of Cedarman. Enjoy. So you want sarung, yeah? I would love one of those, yeah. Just, just two set, one. Which one you want? And then I will make a lot of them. Okay. This one, this one, this one. This is the gate and they never opened the door. Since 17th century. The temple, just look at the ceiling on that. Wow. Here's another roof of the inside of one of the temple buildings and it tells the story of the healings and of yoga and they're all hand painted from about the 1700s. Spectacular. <laughs> We've just stopped here for a bite of lunch. What, what are they called? This is Gadu Gadu. Gadu Gadu. And this is? Baksu Babi. Baksu Babi. Babi. Arrived at my new accommodation. This is my room, number two. Look at that. That is amazing. This is the bathroom. Inside, outside. Very clean. And that's my view. And I believe there's a swimming pool down there, which I might have to go and take a dip in. They've just turned up with a welcome drink for me in my new apartment. How nice. I feel like some kind of a princess. I have never slept in a bed with a mosquito net before. This is the first time. It feels very grand. I don't know if you can hear this, but it's raining cats and dogs out there. Sounds like I've left the shower on. Good morning everybody. This is my breakfast on the first morning which is included in the price. So I've got scrambled egg with toast. I've got a passion fruit smoothie. And this is the tea that I bought when I went to the coffee plantation. So they just brought me some hot water for that. I'm going to walk into town today. It's very rural. <laughs> No idea really where I'm going. This is what I wanted. Let me show you. So, not one to ever disappoint, but here we go. Up a hill again. <laughs> I have no idea where I'm going. I don't want to take any turnings though. I just want to stay on the same street. So I've made it to the top of the hill and this I believe is town. So I'm going to walk to one end and then back the other way. This is right near where I'm staying. There's a couple of shops overlooking these rice fields. They're playing the tunes today. 
It is so lovely. Oh my word, I thought I'd just come in for a bit of a chill down using the fan. And over where my toilet is, I have a little friend, Jiminy Cricket's come to say hello. Well, Jiminy Cricket better stay exactly where he is, otherwise he's going to have a headache. <laughs> God, there's so much wildlife, it's ridiculous. Jiminy Cricket is on the moon. I'm watching you. I'm watching you. From the other side of the room, of course. I am not getting too close. If he jumps, I'm off. Oh my God, you won't believe it. He's just flown from there all the way across. And how he's landed on there. Oh my word. Please leave my room, little bug. I feel like such a wuss. The lady came with my lunch. <laughs> she picks the bug up, takes it outside and throws it away. I'm dying. <laughs> I'm not made for all this wildlife. <laughs> this is one of my new favourite fried banana. It's really nice. Oh my god, get rid of Jimmy Cricket and the gecko comes for a visit. This is my little room. And then you come down here, walk along a little path. And there, it's the nicest swimming pool ever. And to top it all, I'm the only one here. It is so quiet. And the water is lovely and cool, so I'm going to have a dip. This is so lovely. It's the coolest pool I've been in since I've been away. It's so refreshing. And to top it all, I have it all to myself. just stopped in this little restaurant to have a drink before we move on for dinner and look at the view. It's lovely. The music's slightly loud but the views are great. Been for a lovely meal in this little restaurant with Sonia and Jackie. 